What's up guys, the Elven Girl here with another episode of Undertale. Oh, look at Toriel reading. Anyway, um, we ended. I ended the episode last time uh, after failing to win against Papyrus. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to, well, win the battle again without killing him. So that will be nice. At least now I know what his famous blue attack uh, holds. So let's do this. Okay. Is he gonna say the same thing again? I oh! Where could that human have gone? Uh, I, I don't know. Wait! It's right in front of me! Hello! I was worried that you had gotten lost. It sure is a relief to know that you're right here. Wait a second. You're not supposed to escape. Get back there. <laughs> okay, so let's flirt with him first. Oh. Oh, I'm already I'm already blue. We're going to start Oh, oh, I can move. Oh. Uh, good to know. But that means I just need to spare him, right? Ooh, whoops. Whoops! <laughs> oh, this makes things a lot easier. Hold up longer to jump higher, jeez. I know, I know. Yeah, don't make me use my special tech. You already whoa, 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 wait a sec, wait, wait a second, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Just when I thought it was gonna be easy. Let's spare him. I can almost taste my future popularity. This is so confusing. Oh. Oh, really? That's just gosh, darn it of the royal guard oh come on holy hell I'm gonna die aren't I when is this over yep you may have cleverly escaped from jail before but this time I've upgraded the facilities not only will you be trapped but you won't even want to leave yeah <laughs> Is not even possible to... What's... Is, is this the upgrade? Is this the upgrade? Really? Okay. Later. <laughs> Let's try again. Gosh. Come on, Papyrus. Back again, eh? I suppose it's my fault. I have a sore throat, so <laughs> I'm really sorry, but I cannot do his voice. <laughs> I told you before that I would make you spaghetti. It's only natural that you will want to see me, in the dire hope that I would make you some. Well, I understand. Papyrus is hungry, too. Hungry for justice. <laughs> oh god. His lines. Oh. Still blue. Okay. Guess I'm gonna stay blue until I defeat him. Ooh. Too bad. <laughs> I was lucky. Oh, I was not supposed to move, of course. Stupid. Oh, come on. 
I have some items left. Yes, monster candy. Gosh darn it. Holy hell. <laughs> Keeps getting better, doesn't it? Because why not? <laughs> Dang it. Ho oh, oh. ho. Whoops, whoops, whoops. <laughs> oh, what did he realize? Oh, I got it. Peter's is considering his options. Will anyone like me as sincerely as you? I don't think so. So just let me go. I suck at this. Oh really? Oh, no. You are persistent. I am. But it just won't work on me. I'm the persistentest. If you think you are persistent, sir. That's <laughs> wrong. Grammatically wrong. <laughs> it is. Because the correct form would be not as persistent as as prepared to... Oh my god. No. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this lesson. Yeah. Did I fail again? I failed again. Yeah. Darn it. So close. Oh gosh, I don't have any items left. Should have bought some. Yep. I finally realized the true reason why. You. Just miss seeing my face so much. Sure. I'm not sure I can fight someone who feels this way. But mostly, I'm getting really tired of capturing you. No. Okay. I guess I'll accept my failure. What? <laughs> That's it? Yeah, online's not... yeah, sure, whatever. I'll never join the Royal Guard, and my friend quantity will remain stagnant. What should you say? <gasps> Let's be friends! Really? You want to be friends? With me? Well then, I guess... I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wow, we We haven't even had our first day! And I've already managed to hit the friends. <laughs> <laughs> Not sure that's a good thing though. Who knew that all I needed to make pals was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? <laughs> Who knew? You thought me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through. Yes, and I'll give you directions to the surface. What? Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. Like you. And that's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Aha. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To, to reach the exit, you will have to pass. Through the king's castle. Oh shoot. The king of all monsters. He is. Well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I'm certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. Yeah. What? Let's go have a date. <laughs> Not sure if that's possible, but let's check it out. Oh, there he is. Hey there, Papyrus. So you came back to have a date with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. 
Oh, we're actually doing this. Okay. Awesome. <laughs> Where are you going? Is he going back home? My house! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Ew, fancy. Aha! Interested in my food museum. That's a refrigerator. <laughs> half of the fridge is filled with containers all labeled spaghetti. The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Awesome. Welcome to my to scenic my house. Enjoy and take your time. What's this? That's my room. If you've finished looking around, we could go in and do whatever people do when they date. Go inside? No, not yet. <laughs> nice, nice picture. <laughs> What's up with this? The door's locked. Okay. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Sure, why not? Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. God damn it. There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. <laughs> Good idea. Oh, it's my favorite game show. It says, stay tuned for a new program, MGT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode, don't judge me. Sure, whatever. Let's see what happens when we enter. Yes. <laughs> nice collection you got there. Ah, yes, action figures. A great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa! <laughs> nice. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start a date? <laughs> sure. Okay, dating start! <laughs> Dating. Start. Here we are, on our date. I've actually never done this before. <laughs> but don't worry, you can... You can spell prepared without several letters from my name. God damn it, Pierce. I snagged an official dating rulebook from the library. We're already we're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one. Press C key on your keyboard. Oh, what the... Wowee, I feel so informed. I'm not sure what's happening. I think we're ready for step two. Step two, ask them on a date. Ahem, <coughs> human. I, the Grey Papyrus, will go on a date with you. Sure. <laughs> oh, that face. <laughs> really? Wowee. I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three, put on nice clothes to show you care. Wait a second. Wear clothing. That pendant's hanging off of you. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that, earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be? You wanted to date me from the very beginning. <laughs> sure. No! You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! No! Your dating power! What the... Yeah! Yeah! Don't think you've bested me yet. I, the Grey Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating. <laughs> and I never will. I can easily keep up with you. I've never once had a date like this. You see, I too can wear clothing. No way. In, fa in fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on the date. Behold. Oh, wow. Oh. <laughs> yeah, what do you think of my secret style? I love it. No, a genuine compliment. Oh, shit. However, 
You don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. Ah, oh, goddammit. This state won't escalate any th further. Unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. My head, my head, my head! Yeah! Well, well then, you found my secret. What the fuck is that? I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. Oh, it's a present. A present just for you. Should I open it? It, it could be his brains. And sure, let's open it. Do you know what this is? Is it spaghetti? Of course. Spaghetti? <laughs> yes, it's spaghetti. That's what you're thinking. Right. But oh, so... God damn it. This ain't any plain old sp pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti. Finely aged in <laughs> an oaken cask. Okay, then cooked by me, Master Chef prepared. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. Should I eat it? Or should I refuse? Let's eat it. You take a small bite. Your face reflexively crunches up. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression. You must really love my cooking. And by extension, me. <laughs> Maybe even more than I do. Wow. Oh, <laughs> nailed it. <laughs> Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy, too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus, fucking hate you. <laughs> I, um, boy, is it hot in here? Or is it just me? Ooh, hot in here. <laughs> oh, shoot. Human, I, I'm sorry. I don't like you the way... God damn it, Papyrus. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flitted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But that as I, the great Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend. And act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. It will be tragic to lose your friend. God damn it, Papyrus. So please don't cry because I won't kiss <laughs> Because I don't even... Have lips. Of course. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for second best. God damn it, Papyrus, why you do this to me? Oh, and if you <laughs> need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. Platonically. Well, gotta go. God damn it. Jerk. I'm just gonna go over here and cry in the corner. So, yeah, well, yeah, that happened. So, we sort of beat at Papyrus, even though we didn't do anything to him. All we did was feel and feel and feel miserably and then he just decided to stop fighting with us then we went on a date with him and apparently he's a douche who doesn't like us so suck it suck it anyway <laughs> this game is just it just keeps surprising me and i've had so much fun playing this up until now so i hope you enjoyed watching as well if you did leave a like because that's always nice and hopefully I will see you in the next part of Undertale. Because I think we're getting... We're, we're going to a new area. So that's awesome. Really curious. As you can see I'm already walking now. 
And I guess I will save this for the next part. So thank you for watching and bye!